Hello friends, this is Sean, WB6JWB. Just a quick video. I had a need to lower the output power of my Kenwood TM271A. I use a solar powered battery operated remote base station. So I wanted to set the power to as low as possible on this radio. Of course we've all read online about uh, you can do it via a menu option. I haven't tried that but I don't think you get the best result with the menu option if my read is correct. Or there's an adjustment known as VR1 which if you open up the top of the radio and you take the top metal plate off VR1 is about right here, a little tiny variable resistor. And so I'm going to demonstrate what the lowest possible output power can be achieved. Of course here in the uh, shop I'm using a 13.8 volt DC supply. So under my real conditions using a battery operated solar charged power supply it will actually be less than what, what I achieve here. So I need a little magnifying glass in order to put my screwdriver in VR1, so bear with me a minute. Just a little tiny sucker. There we are, I think. So I'm going to put it in transmit, and you see the power go up. Now I've got the radio on the low power setting. If you can see the needle swing down there, the lowest possible setting in low power under these conditions is 10 watts in the low power setting. WB6 JLUB test. Which should be about adequate for my purposes. I would prefer to take it down to 5 watts or even 2 watts, but uh, using VR1, the lowest possible setting is approximately 10 watts. I hope that helps and validates before you bust into your radio what can be achieved using VR1 or physically adjusting it to lower the output power. 73.